Hi, this is Chris from The Stephanie Miller Show. Please enjoy this exclusive clip from Political Voices Network. But your comments today make me wonder if you have read the special counsel's report at all. The her report does help us draw a distinction between President Biden and Donald Trump, just not the one you want. Two distinctions, actually. First, the report is clear that, quote, at no point did the special counsel find evidence that Mr. Biden intended or had reason to believe the information would be used to injure the United States or to benefit a foreign nation, close quote. Chris Bloy, you are correct. What? And I never start a sentence like that. That's uh-huh. weird. I am I, correct. No, we, feeling all right? we all said it, but you said it first yesterday. Yes. This is why I, this was, I guess, a good idea, as, as despicable as Robert Hur is in this whole mm-hmm. thing, is because our side is so good. Yep. Mm-hmm. Oh my God, they're like legal... Eagles. X-Men. I don't know. What's the, what's the superhero thing I'm... They're like a legal Volt- Voltron. Yes. She Hulk. them. They're superheroes. She Hulk. She's a lawyer. Yes. Yes. She Hulk and Captain America and whatever. Voltron. They're just. Yeah. I, there you go. Jody was saying, I we could have gotten four pages of sound. Oh, bites. easily. The, they were so good. They turned this hearing, of course, into just completely exposing what a criminal Donald Trump is and how Joe Biden was completely exonerated. I, I love, I don't even remember now who asked, like, can you be a little bit charged? <laughs> like, oh, yeah. You're either charged or you're not, right. and then you shut the up. Yeah. Right. As Harry Lippman said to us yesterday, and how despicable that Robert Hur not only lied, he lied about Biden not knowing when his son yes, died. Yes, he did. I mean, we said this yesterday because I, I, that had already, you know, leaked out about the whole. Of course, his report didn't include no. the whole transcript where he got the exact date right. Yep. And furthermore, the transcript shows Joe Biden, as her said, to have a photographic memory. Sure. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God. Well, do we have that yes, one, we Eric do. Swalwell? It's... I mean, funny, engaged. Oh, my God. Uh, which one? Uh, la, la, la. Uh, 11. 11. Okay, yeah, here it's we your go. fault. Good luck. I know. I want to turn you to the transcript and day one, page 47. You said to President Biden, you have appear to have a photographic understanding and recall of the House. Did you say that to President Biden? Those words do appear on page 47 of the transcript. Uh, what a weasel. Photographic is what you said. Is that right? That word does appear on page ah, 47 that word of the transcript. Does appear? Never appeared in your report, though. Is that correct? The word photographic? That does not appear in my report. What a weasel. Yep. Mm-hmm. What a bunch of weasel yep. words. Yep. It, your re- who wrote your report? You. You wrote your report. It's like, and, oh, yeah. And you said that in, in the transcript. Yeah. And, uh, you know, right after he was trying to uh, trying to remember, uh, right as he was trying to remember his, his, you know, when his son passed away, they had just got done discussing a whole bunch of other dates. Right. And so, you know, right. he was kind of, and so Biden was kind of talking out loud, yeah. which was recorded in the transcript. Yeah. Right. Um, yeah. You know, trying to re- trying to get all the dates that, that they had gotten straight. It, it wasn't that he couldn't remember the date that his son died. I know. It was... And that, he knows that. Right, Robert exactly. Hur, I mean, Allison Gill said Robert Hur lied about the president. Joe Biden did not get the date of his son's death wrong. It's bad enough for a prosecutor to lie for political purposes, but to do so about this, this subject yeah. is unconscionable. Yep. I mean, I, and the GOP was mad that the transcript was released. Exactly. Oh, of course, they as they always it. are. Yes. This is why Hunter Biden didn't want to do this behind closed doors because mm-hmm. they're liars. Yep. Mm-hmm. They're all, I, 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 you know what? There's a lot of people pointing out what we we always say here first because we're because we get up at uh, at stupid o'clock. You're welcome. This is why you see what happened with Bill Barr. They mm-hmm. just have no right that he completely twisted what the Mueller report said. And mm-hmm. this is like you were saying, Joey. This is why they don't want the whole transcript released because they want to do their own partisan hack, mm-hmm. you know, reports. So yeah, the, all the, all of the stuff that Robert Hur didn't put in his report that was in the transcript shows that he is just a complete liar mm-hmm. and partisan hack. Yep. Uh, Joe Biden, by the way, to the contrary, seems sharp as attack. Yeah. And funny and, and, you know, congenial and completely forthcoming. They even asked him at one point, do you want to take a break? And he's like, no, 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 let's just get, you know, let's, let's get through this. Yeah. Let's, you know. Oh, my God. Where I, what's your other favorite, Jody? What is oh, this? I oh. do like it when Swalwell asked if he would work for Donald Trump. Oh, that. Yeah. But wait. Oh, Madeline Dean making him oh, yeah. read his own report. <laughs> it starts 17. 17, yeah. 17 yes. Mm-hmm. Okay. Here we go, Matt. You have a copy of your report today, don't you, in front of you? I Could do. you read a portion of it for me? Uh, your words, it is page 11, starting on line three, beginning with the words, unlike the evidence involving Mr. Biden. Would you read the next few sentences? 
Unlike the evidence involving Mr. Biden, the allegations set forth in the indictment of Mr. Trump, if proven, would present serious aggravating facts. Yes, and keep continue. going. Yeah. Keep going. <laughs> Congresswoman, I'm happy to have you read the words in my report. Well, it's your report, so I think it actually is more fitting that you read those. Most notably, after being given multiple chances to return classified documents and avoid prosecution, Mr. Trump allegedly did the opposite. Keep going. Keep going. According to the that. indictment, he not only refused to return the documents for many months, but he also obstructed justice by enlisting others to destroy evidence and then to lie about it. You may stop there. <laughs> that was like a teacher. Go Keep going. Oh, my mm -hmm. God. Yes. Who do we, who's the lawyer? She-Hulk. Madeline Dean. She is she a She-Hulk, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Adam Schiff, Captain America. Mm -hmm. They were all just, uh, they were all great. Yeah. I mean, it just, that's what you were saying, is they're just so outmatched over there. Exactly. That it, 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 it you know, so they use this to, because obviously some of the truth, particularly is in the transcript, in terms of the Donald Trump, this is a complete 180 difference. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, and I don't know if I like Nadler or Swalwell's montage of Trump. I know. <laughs> They were forgetting both great. And, and stumbling. Did, you heard already, right? Trump said it was AI. AI, yeah. Trump no. says those montages no. were AI. No. Oh my God. This is what this election is going to be like. Yes. They're going to do AI about Biden and claim that's real. And the real stuff about Trump, they're going to claim anything that makes him look bad is AI. Uh -huh. I mean, yep. this is because we're in the which timeline? The stupidest. The stupidest Wait, timeline. Thank you. Thank the you, silliest Chris. timeline? Thank you, Chris. The worst? I'm still, you know what happens? There's the thing that I was going to say is still swimming around in the soup up here, and it's distracting me. Might have been Hunter what Biden. What is it that we said first? We were talking about Hunter Biden at one point. It's all for you. It's all for you. And then we just went, yeah. took a left at Albuquerque. I was hijacked by my own comedy bit. You were. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Had to go with that omen reference, didn't I? Well, that omen reference is, a, is an evergreen. It really is. Has anyone ever checked that orange nest to see if there's sixes? It could be sixes. Oh, I'm sure there are. How would you know? There's too much hairspray and Ugh. God, aquanet plugs, and I don't know what's up there. Uh, yeah. All right. Anyway, uh, yeah. No, it just, I, I guess that's why, <laughs> as pissed as we were yesterday, mm -hmm. I'm glad they did it because, they, oh, my God. Not only did they expose what a liar he is and that, that you know, Biden is not a, what do you say, a well-meaning elderly man with blah, blah, blah. I mean, what do you, the poisonous thing he's trying to put out there is, oh, he's guilty, but I, I couldn't have, I couldn't have gotten a conviction. Because he's, that is bull, sweet. Huh? He couldn't have gotten a conviction because Joe Biden's a nice guy. Uh, right. No, he couldn't have gotten a conviction because he it, didn't do exactly. he, And he said it right in there. Yeah. He said it in the thing that there was no, you know, I, I, I don't know exactly how he said it. But it, I, obviously it's in the report, mm -hmm. in the, the whole transcript. Uh, yeah. I, <laughs> help. Mommy needs help from Twitter. Oh, uh, uh, Jojo from Juris says the fact that Republic that Republicans didn't expect the Democrats to turn this whole show into a hearing, into an opportunity to showcase Donald Trump's criminality and senility tells you everything you need to know about them. Mm -hmm. They are they're such doofy, plural. Mm -hmm. You know Ken Buck. Uh, is that who you are? What you like to do? Obviously, he's, both at this point. He's leaving. He, yeah. Even he's disgusted, and he knows like that now they have a razor. He's leaving next week. I yes. love it. Had a man. We knew this was his last. His last. Yeah, his and he term, actually but... cited uh, Jim Jordan yeah. not giving him seniority yesterday at the hearing. Yeah. Why? Because he's not Trumpy enough. Yep. Right. Because he won't do the talking points that Jim Jordan wants him to do. Yep. And, I, well, who was the one <laughs> idiot that said? Like Did you find Lurch. Joe Biden to be senile? senile? Yeah. No. He's like, first of all, even Barbara Heard have to say, no. "What is he a doctor?" Right. No, he didn't find him to be. In, in fact, the opposite. Who uses the term photographic? You have a photographic memory of, you know, X, Y, and Z. I mean, okay, I don't. Let's pick another one. <laughs> I mean, it's, oh, Ted Lou, our hometown hero here in Los Angeles. Uh, oh, yeah, he was great. Yeah. Got 12, yeah. So here's my first question. In your investigation, did you find that President Biden directed his lawyer to lie to the FBI? We identified no such evidence. Did you find that President Biden directed his lawyer to destroy classified documents? No. Did you find that President Biden directed his personal assistant to move boxes of documents to hide them from the FBI? No. Did you find that President Biden directed his personal assistant to delete security camera footage after the FBI asked for that footage? No. Nope. <laughs> Please continue. Yes. Did you find that President Biden showed a classified map related to an ongoing military operation to a campaign aide who did not have clearance? No. Did you find that President Biden engaged in a conspiracy to obstruct justice? 
No. Did you find that President Biden engaged in a scheme to conceal? No. Each of the activities I just laid out describe what Donald Trump did in his willful mishandling of classified information and his criminal efforts to deceive the FBI. In contrast, President Biden handed over documents without delay and complied fully with investigators. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Uh, a number of people on Twitter. Adam uh, tweets, this is at least the third major hearing recently where I've seen Comer and Jordan have done incredible damage to the Republican Party in yep. their attempt to damage America and its president. <laughs> These are their hearings. <laughs> and yeah. they are humiliated live on TV. My conclusion is they enjoy it. Rude Pundit, his, you know, always has to be a little rude, well, said, yes. I am telling you, Jim Jordan gets off on being publicly humiliated. <laughs> I'm not kink shaming. I just wish he'd stop dragging the rest of us <laughs> along to watch. He was edging. He, doesn't, he does not want to yuck anyone's yum. No. But, was, yeah. Jim Jordan was edging the entire he, time. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what else. To, they're already, you know, behind closed doors admitting they're looking for an off-ramp yeah, for this are. impeachment. Because they don't, uh -huh. they just are. Yeah. I just always picture Jim Jordan with a clown nose and James Palmer with big shoes just getting back in the Volkswagen. Just, oh, 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 oh. I just don't know what to say. Another big exploding comedy cigar sure. in the Republican space. I told you it would happen. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah. After the one-two punch of the State of the Union, you know what this transcript showed? The Joe Biden we saw at the exactly. State of the Union, right. the real Joe Biden, yep. not this caricature. And now they're just like, burp, derp. <laughs> That's the Eric, by the way. That's my. I'm Eric. Burp. That's my impression of the Republican Party today. <laughs> no, okay. Mrs. Eric is in charge of the. Uh... <laughs> Oh, Mrs. Eric. Uh -huh. <laughs> arr, 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 arr. Wow. Yeah, I think we have to be. I think that we have to be happy with that. We've just blown up the entire RNC right before. The